Yes, you've read the title correctly. There is a town in Pennsylvania that is always on fire. In fact, it has been burning since May 1962. This town is called Centralia. This is a town with a base of coal mining. We don't exactly know how this happened, but three are three ideas. The first idea is that a group of five firefighters had some landfill. In May 1962, these volunteers burned it. They then put it in a pit, but the fire wasn't properly extinguished. An opening let fire get to the coal, causing heaps of fires, even to this day. The second idea is that it was actually a trash hauler. They could have dumped hot ash or some coal into this pit, causing fires. The last theory is that the vast colliery fire of 1932 never stopped. This was actually proven false, as two brothers would have been killed due to the gases that would be going through the tunnels in a bootleg mine that they owned. The second theory is considered as the most likely to be accurate. It took until 1972 to show the true power the problem had. This happened when a gas station owner, which used to be the mayor, inserted a dipstick to check fuel levels. This dipstick came out as 77.8 degrees Celsius. Someone in 1981 then almost died, which was a 12-year-old kid. He fell into a sinkhole, almost killing him. His 14-year-old cousin thankfully saved him. There was some hot steam coming from the sinkhole too, which contained lethal levels of carbon monoxide. They eventually started to leave, and only seven residents remained in October 29, 2013. These residents got rights to live in Centralia, despite the fires. Now there are five residents, 